Immediately following the death of Nikola Tesla, Dr. John Trump, an electrical engineer with the National Defense Research Committee of the Office of Scientific Research and Development, and interestingly, President Donald Trump's uncle, was called in to analyze the Tesla papers. After only three days, John Trump officially concluded that Tesla's work was primarily speculative and did not include workable methods. We are then told that most of Tesla's papers disappeared, but his work most definitely quietly continued. Heavily funded military projects studying the Tesla particle beam are reported, but more interesting than that is the mystery of systems in rotation, spin. Although everything down to the electron seems to be spinning, there is no official study on the science of spin or rotation. But there are fragments and clues that suggest major governments have been secretly studying the science of rotation ever since World War II, calling it hyperdimensional physics or torsion physics. Bruce De Palma's spinning ball experiment from 1977 is simple enough for anyone to repeat. Two steel balls are repeatedly launched with equal force. One is spinning, the other is not. The spinning ball consistently flies higher and falls faster than the other. This is in direct violation of both Newton's laws and Einstein's relativity. Modern science cannot account for this energy. The top secret so-called Nazi Bell project allegedly involved two counter-rotating cylinders and produced anti-gravity UFO-like effects. And now the US Navy appears to be going public with this science. They claim to control inventions that change the fabric of reality. A mysterious Dr. Salvatore Cesar Paez has filed four patents of which the US Navy is the assignee. They appear to be technology for what we would popularly describe as UFOs. And they are all based upon harvesting energy from the spinning of electromagnetic fields. These patents look very similar to what whistleblowers claim have been in production for years by weapons manufacturers such as Lockheed Martin Skunk Works. The same UFO-like craft that whistleblowers claim are being prepared to stage a fake alien invasion after decades of deep misinformation, secrecy, and corruption, why bring this powerful technology out into the open today? The chief technical officer of the Naval Aviation Enterprise claims that the U.S. needs these patents because the Chinese are already investing significantly in these technologies. So are they rolling all this out into the public to prepare us for a space age war with China? The subtext to all this, of course, is that there is no energy crisis, only more lies and deceit. For Infowars.com, this is Greg Reese. It's hard to believe that we're already into the middle of April and our borders collapsing and world governments being announced and Joe Biden's coming after our guns and trying to start a war with Russia and but told China they could take over Hong Kong and Taiwan. So China's done a blockade around Taiwan and is threatening to invade Hong Kong. They already sent troops into Hong Kong. This is madness. And our government's been hijacked now by these globalists and they're trying to shut us down. They took our sponsors away a long time ago. But you sponsor us by buying products direct. So these are already great products you need. Whether it's Vitamin Mineral Fusion back in stock or whether it's Winter Sun or whether it's Lung Cleanse, they're all 40% off individually, 50% off when you order them in combos or together. But regardless, it funds the info war, which is a 360 win. So at this critical time in history with all this craziness happening, I want to thank you all for your support. I want to remind you, these are products you and your family already need, and they fund the info war, a true 360 win. So take advantage of these products today. Find them at InfoWarsStore.com.